Hey guys, Toaster Bath for One Hive Labs. Bring you another episode of Run of the Mill. This one's done by Andrew, and it is basically just a straight hog attack. He's got a golem in the clan castle to do a little tanking over here to get to the queen, as well as a jump spell and wizards for his funnel and cleanup. A couple witches to take care of the enemy clan castle. Breakdown of this base, he sends three hogs to each of these defenses. Gets the clan castle lure there, and then hogs path down, trigger a giant bomb that was here. Easy anchor over here, nothing that's going to hit, so he just drops one archer. Follow that up with barbs, which is his queen. Golem comes down here, starts tanking these point defenses, drops a wizard, creates his funnel. Creates his funnel over on this side. Wall breakers to get into this compartment here. There ends up being a set of bombs that he triggers. Jump spell to get access to the queen. And then once all that's taken out, it's just a straight hog attack. Two finger drop coming down. Hogs path around the base this way. He saves five to come in here and start taking out these defenses in case there was a uh, double bomb there. Once... All these defenses are down. A couple of wizards around the base for cleanup. So that's the breakdown there. Let's take a look at the replay. All right, so here he goes with the attack. Three hogs to each one of those defenses. And he gets a couple things done here. He gets the lure. And once those two defenses go down, you'll see his hogs path in a way that he eliminates a possible double giant bomb spot. Good scout by Andrew here, knowing that that one archer is out well outside the range of any of those buildings. Barbs, witches, queen, wizards go down to take out the enemy clan castle troops. Once he finishes that up, he's going to go ahead and drop his golem down in a way that it tanks all three of those archer towers and the wizard tower. There it goes down. You'll see the balloon's not quite down yet. It's going to beat up on that golem a little bit, but that's okay. Creates the other side of his funnel, and smart move here, dropping his wall breakers in a spot that the wizard tower and mortar are not going to hit them. Kill squad's pushing in, jump spell goes down because that queen's a little out of range, she's not going to jump over that wall. Ends up triggering two more of the four giant bombs, so there's only one left in the base somewhere. Hogs go down, two finger drop, and you'll see they path through the core nicely. He's going to have three heals to keep them up. And first one goes down here, that's a good spot for that one. Expos have a lot of hit points, and those Teslas can really take your hogs out quickly while they're just standing there beating on bows. So, good move healing through the core. Couple of hogs for the backside. Wizard Tower's not going to hurt those five hogs that he drops, so they're going to take out those buildings. Final Giant Bomb goes off, tops that pack of hogs up with his final heal spell. And right about now, you'll see he starts dropping the three wizards that he had on the backside for cleanup. We'll go ahead and speed up the replay. Um, that was smart on his part, dropping those wizards where he did. You want to try and save the wizards and drop them wherever your hogs don't end up. So his hogs ended up on the south side there, drops them on the north side so that the cleanup process ends up being even faster. So nice attack, Andrew, three star, 100%. Basically just a straight hog attack with uh, kill squad to take care of the enemy clan castle and queen. Guys, remember to hit the little thumbs up button if you like this video. Also, if you haven't done so already, please subscribe to our channel. We've got more videos like this and others coming to you. Remember to check out the links in the description below, and we'll see you guys later.